to World Pumpers, and we are here at California Adventure for the Food and Wine Festival. We got a sip and savor pass. So yeah, stay tuned. We're gonna check out all of the different food items. Up here is gonna be peppers caliente. This looks really good. Okay, here we go. We got the camarones. Uh, I forgot what it was called, but it's like spicy shrimp over rice. And here we got the empanada. These both look very good. Both really great. I think I liked the shrimp a little bit better. I like the empanada. I like the empanada better. They're both fantastic, though. I highly recommend those. Those are really, really good. Definitely some great items and really worth it for the time. Next up, we're gonna check out avocado time. Check it out. All right, here we go. We've got the impossible pork, or not pork, impossible al pastor taco. Looks really good. And then also right here, we got some construction for San Francisco. Look, they're doing a bridge right here. That looks super cool, and they're doing all these facades. Super exciting. Can't wait to see how this turns out. That taco was pretty good. I think the other two items we've had so far were better for sure. Wasn't bad. Just wasn't as flavorful as I would like it to be, maybe, but definitely pretty good. Really, really good. I give it probably like three out of five stars. So, a really quick tip is you can go order at any of the locations. You don't have to actually be ordering at the location you're picking up from. You can order and they'll just give you a receipt. You don't, because if some of them have like really long lines, like this place had a really long line for ordering, but not a long line for picking up the food. So, we just went and ordered down to the location over there for right here, which is really nice. All right, so here we got the Cubano slider from Delish and the carbonara mac and cheese from Garlic Kissed, I think. So yeah, these look, both look really good. All right, so I'd say they're both pretty good. Not our favorite items, but the carbonara mac and cheese gets a three out of 10 for me. Maybe a three, I'm sorry, no. <laughs> Gets a three out of five for me. Maybe like a three and a half out of five. The Cubano sandwich definitely gets like a four out of five. That was pretty good. That was one of my favorites. What do you think? Yeah, no, definitely. I think the empanada and the shrimp were better, but it's still pretty good. Oh yeah, both the empanada and the shrimp, I would say, were five out of five for sure. All right, here we got two more items. We got the olive tamponade artichoke toast. This looks really good. And then the Echo Park cooler drink. I think it's some sort of type of tea, I think. It's really good. All right, we finished these two. I'd say, the drink was a solid five out of five. That was really, really good. That was one of my favorite things we've had. And the artichoke toast was pretty good too. I think like a four out of five, just a little bit of a small portion. What did you think, Murray? Yeah, definitely. They're both really good. This is really, really yummy. All right, we use our last tab here on the IPA sausage dog. This looks really good. Let's see how it is. All right, that was the best item I had. For sure, five out of five. I highly recommend that one. What'd you think, Murray? It was great. The sausage was really, really good. Yeah, it was a pretzel bun. It was really, it was like sweet and salty. That was really good. By far the best item here. I highly recommend it. All right, well, we used up all of our tabs and I found, think that that festival was great. There's some really great items. By far my favorite was the IPA sausage drug. What do you think? Yeah, for sure. That was definitely the best one. The drink was also great. And the yeah, that's was true. Overall, really good. There were a few things that were like, is this really worth the $59? But overall, it was a pretty good festival. Oh yeah, I definitely uh, recommend yeah, it. Definitely, for sure. But like, yeah, make sure you order what you want because those tabs are worth a lot. Yeah. But yeah, great event overall. That's going to do it for our video today. Thank you so much for watching World of Immersion. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Check us out on Instagram and TikTok at World of Immersion. And thanks for watching.